What's going on ladies and gentlemen, DGFX or Nick here, and I want to welcome you guys to my 2016 workstation trading setup. Take a look. The whole setup starts off with three 24 inch ViewSonic gaming monitors. These monitors include 2 millisecond response time which is perfect for PS4 gaming or even PC gaming. Now moving down to the thing that captures it all is the Logitech C920 HD webcam. This webcam is perfect for face cams and videos as well as talking to friends simply on Skype. Now to capture the lovely voice I use an Audio-Technica USB condenser microphone. It is fitted with a pop filter as well as a shock mount that is hooked up to a boom. Now, on my desk, I use a Creative Labs desktop speakers. I got these speakers a few years ago and these things are amazing. They have a good balance between bass and vocals when listening to music and editing. Moving over to my keyboard now, I use a Logitech Illuminated Keyboard. Same as the speakers, I've had this thing for a really long time and it's amazing. With adjustable brightness on the keys, I can choose between different viewings, whether I'm needed bright for night or kind of dim for the day. It's a very sleek design to it and feels very well built. The mouse as well is a Logitech gaming mouse with underneath a steel pair series mouse pad. I never really had a great mouse pad until I got to this one and it really just fits everything perfect. Now, when I'm working on my PC, doing editing, gaming, I use Bluteo headphones. These are some 3.5mm headphones that just plug into a regular headphone jack and these things are extremely comfortable. These are perfect for long hours of viewing time, listening time, and I highly recommend them. Now, when I'm gaming on the PlayStation 4 though, I do use Triton AX720 surround sound headphones. I've been having these as long as a keyboard and these are amazing. These Tritons plug into the back of my PlayStation 4 via optical digital which gives you clear, consistent sound while gaming. Again, these are very comfortable and perfect for long hours of gaming. Now my PS4 is a 500 gigabyte PlayStation 4 standard package. I do keep a space for my Canon Rebel T3i on my desk, as well for a little tripod and a few extra batteries for the camera while making videos and stuff. This extra battery pack comes very, very helpful. I do have a few other desk extras on my desk, um, a few trading books, a few games, and a place where I can keep my paperwork as well. A couple mints and a glass, and it pretty much wraps up my whole entire desk. Now moving below the desk is where all the magic happens. I have a Cooler Master computer built with an i7 47.7K with a GTX 560 Ti graphics card as well as a Radeon graphics card to run my extra monitors. I have 16GB of RAM with an SSD, an SSHD, and dual HDDs for a total of 3.6 terabytes of storage. Oh, this computer for editing, gaming, and trading. This is my perfect workstation for now. And I do have a few future upgrades, but as of now, this is what gets the job done. My whole desk is equipped with 16 feet of RGB LED lighting. This lighting is very bright and is a very eye appealing to the desk and really just kind of brings everything together. Now lastly to the setup, I have a few extra little things. Um, I have a 46 inch Samsung TV mounted to the side. I have a Panasonic 500 watt sound system with a 250 watt sub that comes with it. This thing hits very hard and sounds amazing. The 46 inch Samsung as well as attached to my computer to where I can throw up Netflix and movies up there when I want to have friends over and just have a little bit of a movie night. Alrighty guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a like and comment below of what you guys think of the setup. I did my best for you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. DJFX out.